YouTube. My name is Layla for those of you who don't know and for those of you who do know welcome back to my channel So y'all today is actually my first day of school. I'm super excited It is currently 5 54 a.m. And I am super excited for my first day of school y'all I feel like this school year is gonna bring so many new opportunities and I'm an upperclassman this year y'all It is literally my junior year So I'm gonna be bringing you guys along with me on my first day of my junior year right now I'm about to start on my first day makeup. My outfit is already picked out So I'm gonna show you guys but with that being said, let's get into my makeup routine <laughs> Ever since I went and got my facial, y'all, my skin has literally been glowing. Like, I don't know what's up, but I like it. If I have time, I'm probably going to go to Chick-fil-A for breakfast because this school year, I want to start working on eating a full breakfast before I go to school. So if we have time, we're going to start. Also, y'all, my outfit that I picked out is so cute. I cannot wait to show you guys my outfit. Honestly, I can't even believe that summer's already over, y'all. Summer felt like it literally flew by. But at the same time, I know this school year is going to bring so many new opportunities. And I'm kind of excited to see where this school year takes me. After I finish my makeup, I'm going to show you guys my outfit and then we're going to go ahead and get ready for the day. Alright y'all, so I am done with my makeup. Here's the outfit that I'm going to be wearing and then I'm going to put it with my new palette. So I'm about to record my reel. I need to leave the house by like 6.20 and it's like 6.14. So I have to hurry up and record my get ready with me reel and then we're going to go fill up my Stanley. So after I record this reel, I will get back with you guys. Alright y'all, so here's the outfit. So it is currently 6.28. I have to leave my house by 6.30. So I'm going to go ahead and put all my accessories and my perfume. And we're going to leave the house. I want to enjoy things and have fun. And live like every day is the last day. And that'd be nice. So I'm at Chick-fil-A and I just ordered my food. It's currently 6.50 and I have to be in school by 7.10. But the line is moving pretty fast. School is like five minutes away. So I'm not really tripping on what time I get there. Because when I get there, I'm going to meet up with Michaela And then she's going to take my pictures. And then we're going to go inside of school. So thank you. My pleasure. Your nails look so cute. Thank you. Thank you. You too. Alright y'all, I just got my food. So I'm going to see you guys when I get to school. Alright y'all, I just pulled up at school. I'm with MK. Hey y'all. We're not going to be able to take our pictures right now because we did both get here a little bit late. I have to go get my ID and my parking pass. I have no idea when I'm going to get either one of those, but we're definitely going to be taking pictures later. So I'm going to be showing you guys. But yeah, we're at school. First day is juniors. Yes, oh. So I'll be checking in with you guys throughout the day and of course showing you guys our pictures. But for right now, we're about to head into school. So... See you guys later. I'm 
photography right now. I'm so excited that I'm taking this class, y'all. I didn't think that they were going to put it on my schedule, but they actually did. So I'm super excited to take this class and learn more about my camera and my camera settings. We have six more minutes in this class, and then I go to chemistry. I'm probably going to take my pictures out for school or sometime to clean it. But for right now, we're going to have to change class. My first class was English, and it was pretty chill. We were just going over the basics of everything. So overall, the first day, really chill. Hey guys. Period, we at school. I think what, what class is She got a boyfriend. Who got a boyfriend? Stop. <laughs> we in chemistry, y'all. Um. When would you need to complete a responsibility? Okay. When can you? Wanna be in a vlog? This ID is making my thingy look so ugly. Y'all make sure y'all subscribe to her and get her to 3K. You know what I'm saying? Period. We're doing these stations to discover the classroom. It's been such a chill day, Loki. I literally asked him if I put that stuff on. He talking about no. I didn't say nothing. What are you We got a whole hour left until lunch. I don't know. I ain't really need to ever. Nah. I'm just gonna finish these stations. So All right, but we'll be out to the I'm gonna actually see y'all at lunch this time. Hey, y'all. It's so hot at school, y'all. We're at lunch. Period. It's so hot. Make sure you do subscribe to Lay Fam. Lay Fam is crazy. It's the end of the day. End of the first day. End of the first okay. day. Follow me at Macari Devon on Instagram. Yeah. Period. And you should. <laughs> I don't got no Instagram. I'm already. <laughs> you don't know. <laughs> oh, oh, okay. Y'all, it's the end of the first day. I think today was really like a 9 out of 10. Honestly. Was it, it, was, it was bad. It was real chill. Oh. It was baby, don't fall, baby. Don't baby the cake. Okay, the only thing that made it good was my photography class because I'm so excited about that class. But I learned how to say toque train in Spanish. Oh. My last period was math, and I didn't really record in math, but overall, today was pretty good, so now I'm about to take my pictures. Welcome back y'all, it is a little bit later after school and I just want to give y'all a brief recap of my day. The first thing I want to do is kind of tell y'all my schedule because I didn't get to tell y'all during the day and I didn't really get to film in all of my classes. For first period, I have English 3 dual enrollment. For second period, I have photography. For third period, I have chemistry dual enrollment. And then for fourth period, I have algebra 2 honors. And then we have block scheduling, so we have like A days and B days. For my B-Day schedule, I have ACT English, which I'm going to tell y'all, I'm literally so irritated that I'm in that class. And then I have Sociology, which is also a dual enrollment, and then I have Speech dual enrollment, and then a Data Manipulation and Analysis class, which it's not dual enrollment, but it's through LSU. So out of all of my classes, I literally only have one class with Michaela, which is Algebra 2 Honors, and that teacher made a seating chart in that class, which we found out today. So we don't even sit by each other in that class and we don't have lunch together at all. And I have lunch with none of my friends, which is kind of weird for me because during my freshman and sophomore year, I've always had at least one friend on my lunch shift. But Michaela has the first lunch shift both days and then I have the second lunch shift both days. So we don't even see each other anymore and it's kind of crazy because like I said, I've never been without my friends on lunch. My schedule is low-key a bummer this year. I really wanted to get it changed but unfortunately I wasn't able to. I like my photography class and I'm really excited about being able to learn more about my camera and more about camera settings and like videography and photography in itself because it can help me in YouTube even though it's not an actual videography class it's a photography class. I'm still learning about the settings of the camera and like what lighting is best so I feel like it's kind of going to benefit me in a lot of ways for my YouTube channel. And then y'all, I tried to change out of my ACT prep class because I literally scored what I needed to score and my scores were qualifying for me to not take that class and they still put me in that class. 
And then before school started, I was trying to get my schedule changed and I was meeting with my principal and he told me that he was going to let me know, but then he never let me know. So unfortunately, I can't switch out of that class and it kind of hurts my heart because everything in that class I already know and I am doing like ACT work on the side to improve my ACT score, but that's outside of school and I feel like I have other classes that I could have had in that spot, which I was trying to get it switched to, but my counselor told me that I'm going to have to take two extra classes my senior year instead of just taking one this year and one next year since they have me in ACT prep but overall it's okay I mean I'm not gonna really stress about it because it can't harm me it can only help me so I'm just gonna stay in the class and kind of see what it can offer me so I think I'm taking like three or four dual enrollment classes which are through three different colleges so I kind of have a lot on my plate this year it's definitely gonna be a change for me because last year I think I only had like two dual enrollment classes so it's definitely gonna be a change taking pretty much all college classes this year but I'm definitely ready because by the time I graduate from high school I will have an associate's degree so technically I'll be going into college already a junior so everything that I'm doing now is gonna benefit me so overall I'm just gonna deal with the workload I know it's gonna be a lot but I kind of want to challenge myself this year so I'm super excited to see what this year brings me I also really like my speech dual enrollment teacher and my professor because the way it works at our school is like we have a high school teacher but our classes like we have a professor that is online so both my teacher and my professor are really nice they're really flexible so I really love that and I think I'm really gonna enjoy the class because I told y'all in my last videos I don't know which one it was but I did tell y'all that one of my goals was that I wanted to enhance my public speaking skills and in this class that's exactly what we're working on like I'm gonna be giving a speech at the end of the year and everything so this is another class that's going to help me like reach my goals and kind of tie into everything that I thought I was going to want to do at the beginning of the school year so I'm super excited to see how this class kind of helps me grow also my chemistry dual enrollment teacher I took her last year and y'all I could have swore that I was never going to take her class again but here I am my junior year and I'm in her class again but like I said we have a high school teacher and then we also have a professor but on top of our professor she's also assigning us work to help us with our professor's work so even though I kind of didn't want to take her class I think that her being there is overall going to help with my success in the course so I'm kind of glad that I got her because no matter what no matter my other feelings about her I know she's always going to have my back and I'm really not the best in chemistry or really any sciences like that's just not my alley so I do feel like a little extra help in that class cannot hurt also y'all I don't think I'm gonna like my data manipulation class just based off of the simple fact that I already know what it is it's literally exactly the title of the class data manipulation and I don't want to be in that class but apparently it's like part of my pathway progression so I have to take this class to graduate but I'm not gonna like it I already know I'm not gonna be impressed with it at all and honestly it's probably like the most boring class on my schedule this is like the first year that I've never been happy with my full schedule but as I've been saying I'm just gonna deal with it it's only for one year and then most of my classes are benefiting me in the way that I'm getting college credits as well so I'm not too worried about it I'm not gonna stress overall I'm really looking forward to this year but yeah y'all that's basically everything that I have to tell y'all about my schedule my classes were overall good throughout the day I know y'all saw earlier in this video that I wasn't able to take my pictures when I first got to school so Michaela wasn't able to take them but I did get another one of my friends to take them at the end of the day because I literally had no time to take them throughout school and then we have a new law in our state to where we can't have our phones at school and we can't use our phones at lunch either so like we weren't able to take my pictures at lunch so I had to take them at the end of the day but lunch is really gonna be very different for me like I said given that I don't have it with any friends and then the fact that I can't have my phone out at school which means if I want to be on my phone I have to go somewhere like the bathroom where there's no administration to watch me which really sucks because our campus is very open and I like to be outside on lunch but I'm stuck in between having no friends and no phone on my lunch shift so it's kind of I have to pick my battles but even if I want to like edit my YouTube videos we can't have our iPads either so I would literally have to edit in the bathroom so I'm definitely gonna have to find something to occupy me on my lunch times because sitting in the bathroom the whole lunch shift is not it 
But yeah, y'all, that's basically everything that I had to tell you guys about my first day. I hope you guys had a great first day if you have started school already. If you guys enjoyed this video, please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And don't forget to turn on post notifications so you don't miss any of my new uploads. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye!